Hi there, Cosmic Family. My name is Jehle Ali in this incarnation, and today I wanted to leave a short message talking about the energies of the week, and it is going to be short because the principal event is the new moon in Scorpio that happened today. So I'm going to leave that video in the description with the video of uh, the position between Mars and Uranus because these are the events that are determining the energy of the whole week. But I wanted to mention two aspects that are harmonic, and I think they are giving support during this process. And the first one is Mercury Mercury in Sagittarius um, in a sextile with Venus in Libra. Uh, we are going to feel this, uh, this aspect the whole week, but the first half, Mercury is still doing this square with Saturn in Pisces I talked about yesterday. So this transit is uh, enabling connections uh, with others. And let's remember that the energy of Libra, it's not only about relationships or partnerships, but also associations, people who we can associate it with to co-create projects that can cause mutual expansion. So this could apply to relationships too. And also this, is, this aspect is collaborating with the communication of our truth. Um, you know, it's collaborating with uh, smooth the, the things with other people and also to create agreement. And in the context of the new moon in Scorpio, let's remember that the energy of Scorpio is about a great purification. I think this aspect is helping us to take a, a honesty look to ourselves because the elevated energy of Sagittarius is truth, frankness and, and honesty. And uh, to recognize all the areas in which we have sustained uh, imbalances in relation with other people. So maybe this is about uh, recognizing the areas in which we have claimed for things that we didn't learn to give to other people or to give to ourselves, or maybe uh, those areas in which we put aside our desires and needs in order to sustain these relationships. So. We have to understand that these kind of expressions are actually an energy of, uh, in a very unconscious level, an energy of mendicity of love. And this always create anger and resentment on the inside. But also these situations are an invitation to discover ourselves and to learn to give to ourselves what we need. And with this square with Saturn in Pisces, many times what we need is to put a healthy boundary. So this is going to be very important. And... From November 15th, we are going to have another sextile between uh, the Sun and Mars in Scorpio and Pluto uh, retrograde in Capricorn. So I think this one is going to be a very good one because um, this will awake our inner power to, uh, you know, cut with all the abusive energy that many times we allow in our lives, not only from people uh, on the outside or situations on the outside, but also the abusive uh, behaviors we have with ourselves. So uh, after <laughs> this new moon in Scorpio, I think this energy won't be sustainable. And uh, I think this aspect could help us to anchor ourselves in the real direction of our hearts. So I just want to leave this message today. Thank you, everyone, and see you in the next video. Ciao, ciao.